Welcome to your evening yoga practice. Thank you so much for joining me today as we relax the body and calm the mind. We'll start in our seated position, roll the shoulders back, taking out any tension we may have built up throughout our day. And we'll begin today's practice with three deep clearing breaths in through the nose and out through the mouth. Starting to engage our parasympathetic nervous system, activating our body's relaxation response, counteracting any tension and stress we may have gathered today. Start to settle into your body, breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. Lengthening on the exhale to invite a sense of relaxation into the body. On your next inhale, drop the head down to the right shoulder, taking out that tension. Exhale, back to center. Inhale and drop that head down to the left side. Exhale, back to center. Chin comes to chest, stretching the back of the neck. Taking tension we may have built up from computers and phones. Beautiful work, we'll come into a few rounds of our cat cow. Option to keep the eyes closed here and allow your breath to guide you through the movements. Feel the movement starting from the tailbone and flowing up through the spine and back again in a fluid, soothing way. Releasing tension in the back and in the mind. Moving nice and slow today, notice if you're in a rush to hurry Slow down those movements and breathe through. Open the knees and shift your weight back onto your heels, coming into our restorative child's pose. Gently stretching the back and releasing tension in the hips. Option to lengthen the arms in front of you or rest them along your body, whatever is comfortable for you this evening. Gently tuck your chin in slightly to deepen the stretch in your neck. Breathing deeply into the belly, allowing the torso to melt down into your mat. Allow your shoulders to relax as you settle inward, unwinding the mind before bed.
slowly start to walk those hands up we'll meet in a seated position for a yin variation of butterfly pose releasing stored tension in the lower body bring the soles of your feet together and then slowly slide them away from your body further than you would in a regular butterfly we'll take three deep inhalations flowing through your spine and then we'll settle into our pose allow the back to round and feel yourself melting towards the floor use those exhalations to help you further let go Gently begin to lengthen through the spine and come to lay on your back. Hugging one knee into the chest. We'll come into our supine twist as the leg twists over your body, the opposite hand lengthens across the mat. Option to gaze towards those fingertips or gently close down the eyes here. We spend so much time sat in chairs. This is a great posture to counteract the effects of this. Twist pose can also aid in our digestion, helping alleviate any bloating we might feel before bed. releasing the twist 
we come back to center and pull opposite leg into chest. Find that twist on the other side of your body. Relax through your tummy muscles, let go of any tension and breathe into the belly. And we can begin to observe how our breath changes in these different postures. Does it feel more open, more constricted? Focus in on that breath and reduce any mind chatter. Slowly roll yourself back to center and we'll come into our happy baby pose. Hands rest on the outside of our feet, opening the hips, releasing lower back tension. Option to take some slow rocks from side to side, massaging your back as you ground into your mat. Bring those legs together and we'll hug knees into chest as we prepare for our final asana, Shavasana. 
settle into your body here. If you have any lower back tension, you may wish to roll up a blanket and place it under your knees. Shavasana is an invitation to experience one of the most important elements of your practice, surrender. There is no ego in this pose, no effort to be made. Allow yourself to let fully go. Our bodies store memories and emotion in its physical structures. When we practice our asanas, the tension and locked energies are shaken loose. Our shavasana allows these to be released completely. Just witness them and let them go as you sink further into this posture. I invite you to stay in Shavasana for however long you need here. If you feel ready to close down your practice, we'll take a nice stretch together, lengthening out through your body. Gently roll yourself over onto your right side, taking a moment here to come back into your body. Nice and slowly bring yourself into a seated position on your mat. Hands come to heart centre here. Take a few moments to consciously send love and gratitude around your body, thanking it for helping you experience the day as you come to rest this evening. Thank you so much for joining me. Namaste.